Welcome. Today we're going to teach you how to use the Rayjet 300 laser printer with Adobe Illustrator. First, turn on the laser printer. Next, the fan will activate and the cutting board will start to lower. This is completely normal, so don't be too surprised. The steady light will tell you that it is ready, and you will have to raise the cutting board using the up and down arrows. Using the directional arrows, we'll move the laser up, down, and left and right. Position it where your image is going to be cut. And next, by using this metal piece, you'll be able to raise the cutting board and know exactly where you need to be for the laser to cut. Then, by using the same up and down arrows, you'll raise the board until the metal piece falls off. Then you know you're ready. Close the lid and it will beep. This is also normal, and it also means that you're ready. Now we're going to jump over to the computer. Open up Adobe Illustrator. Open up a new file and select RGB. You can name it whatever you'd like. After the canvas is open, you're going to want to place an image, preferably black and white. That's the one that we're using. Even though the image is not in color, we're going to engrave in black and white. Next, you're going to want to it image trace and expand. To show you the cutting, we are going to draw a blue oval around the symbol. The oval is covering the image in white, but we'll fix that in a moment. You're going to want to have the RGB color palette open. By selecting the color, move everything to zero except for the blue. Leave it at 255. Next, hit the invert. Now we're going to go to Edit, Preferences, and Units to make sure that we are in inches. Then with the oval selected, we're going to set the line weight to 0 .001 inch. And now we're ready to print. Go to File, and then Print. The canvas is rotated, but by selecting the printer, go to the top, select the Adobe script, and then go back to the Rayjet printer. It will readjust itself. Now select where you want the image to be, and then hit Setup. Hit continue, and then go to preferences with the Rayjet selected. It may take a while to load, but once you're in, you're going to want to select the material. Today we will be using a birch wood. You're going to want to hit the plus sign at the top right corner. For blue, we're going to be cutting. Make sure that the air assist is on. For black, we're going to be engraving. And then just make sure that the red is set to skip. Our power levels for engrave are going to be 3585, and for the cut, which is blue, we're going to be using power level 90 and speed 1.5. Then click on Next. Make sure that it is set to color. Hit Next again. And then finally the triangle. Hit Print. Adjust your image and then hit print again. Your printer will now respond. It will reset itself at 0, 0 and then start to engrave. After it is finished engraving, it will proceed to cut. When it is finished cutting, it will beep, the steady light will turn on, which means that you're safe to remove your piece. Thank you for watching, and we hope this helped.